As part of the deal with Hezbollah, Israel promised to turn over information on four Iranian diplomats who disappeared during the Lebanese Civil War. But the families of 12 Iranian Jews in the hands of the Islamic Republic protested that no information should be given until the condition of their loved ones is revealed. We spoke with the family members of one of the detainees. Just like the Iranians have their beloved, the diplomats, whose fate they want to know, we also want to know what happened to our beloved. They are children, they are fathers, to families. It's time to find out where they are. While the State of Israel is willing to transfer the secret information regarding the four Iranian diplomats who disappeared during the First Lebanon War, the Ram family are not willing to continue living with the doubt. My father is missing for 13 years already. He tried to escape Iran through the border with Pakistan and to reach Israel, and it's been 13 years since we've heard anything from him. We received no piece of information. We contacted every authority in Israel. No one knows anything. And now there's this prisoner swap. We think it's right that if we give information, relevant to Iran to the Hezbollah, and this I can't understand. We are giving Iranian information to the Hezbollah? This is the last information we have as a bargaining chip with Iran regarding these Jews, 12 Jews including my father. If we give this intel to Iran, we will have nothing to bargain with regarding these Jews. Thirteen years ago, the Ram family succeeded in leaving Iran and immigrating to Israel. It was a secret mission in which they pretended to leave Iran to Cyprus for a vacation, and only from Cyprus did they contact the Israeli embassy wishing to immigrate to Israel. The father of the family did not want to leave all his possessions behind. He returned to the place of his birth in order to take his assets from Iran to Israel. We have very little information from our family in Iran. They looked through the Iranian prisons, but found nothing. They aren't in a regular prison. We have to remember that Iran is not a democratic country. They don't hesitate to execute. We have no information, so we petitioned the Supreme Court to receive information to investigate what our state has done for them, and we found nothing. And so the Ram family continue their day-to-day -day life without knowing what happened and what is happening today to their father.